All right, it's finally here, the cliffhanger that you all have been waiting for. We have the Descender Deluxe Editions uh, collected here. The entire Ascender series, issues 1 through 18. So here is the front, here is the spine, and then here is the back. All right, so this Ascender actually comes after reading Descender Volumes 1 and 2. So we have Volume 1 to here, and here's what it looks like in the you know, all together. So it looks a little... Different, I guess, like a, a reverse Oreo. Yeah, basically. <laughs> I, I would say, yeah. So you have this one. So I, the center one and two is 32 issues. Really great series. And you have this one that comes after the... There was a pretty big cliffhanger in uh, the center volume two. Really okay. big hip cliffhanger. And this basically follows up, I think, a few years down the road, maybe five or ten years, I don't remember, after what happened in this, uh, in this story. For, so for those of you guys who never read A Sender or never read D Sender or, or want to start uh, A Sender, I would highly recommend trying to check this out. I believe the first hardcover is getting reprinted very, very soon. I don't know about volume two, uh, but I would highly recommend checking out D Sender before you check this one out or else you'll be like, yo, what's going on? Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's basically reading the, the finale of a hit series. It's like watching the last Star Wars film and you don't know who all these characters are. Yeah, exactly. So th <laughs> this one's really cool. Uh, yeah, it collects uh, issues 1 through 18 by Jeff Lemire and Dustin Wynn. So let's open it up. Oh, yeah, I have this... I had this in a shirt. I'm gonna do this on my review, actually. Ah, okay, okay. When I do my review, you can see the shirt. So this is this just the first look. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. That's actually one of the coolest shirts that I've seen. I'm like, oh, cool. Yeah. Who that is? <laughs> so you guys haven't read any of these center, I would highly recommend you pause the video now, or like, you know, be be careful what you see. <laughs> but yeah, you have the watercolors and stuff like that. This one <clears throat> basically takes place after book after issue 32 of Descender, and what it is, is you have the, um, following the storyline of their, uh, his child, I forgot his name, but the child that they had. <clears throat> and there's vampires and all these other things now as well. They're, they're basically trying to live, live off the grid. Like, nobody knows about them. I feel like there was another entity that's, like, taking over the world now. I think it's called Vampires. It's been, I think it's been, like, a year or so since I read this, so I need a brush up for when I do my review. <laughs> but, yeah, very, um, I would say it's kind of like a sci-fi, I want to say, it's a, like, a soap opera, but it's very sci-fi, a lot of, like, spaceships, space interactions and stuff like that. If you want, like, a full review... And what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to do like a voiceover review. I'll brush up on volumes one and two and a sender and do kind of like a digital review where I'll talk about the book and then I'll zoom in on some panels and stuff like that on the digital format. That way it, I feel like it'll be a little bit more entertaining. If that sounds cool, let me know. Yeah. Let me know. Uh, the artwork on this is beautiful. I love the watercolor yeah. like that. Yeah, I definitely, like for this series, I will give this, you know, it's, it's definitely going to be in my top five. So we have Invincible, we have Saga, we have Descender, you know. Invincible will never be dethroned. <laughs> uh, for me, at least. Yeah, so the, the, you have the, the end of the series right here. And then I guess there's no extras in here as well. <laughs> oh, that's surprising. Oh, no extras at all. Because in the other books, you have volume two. Uh, you have some black and whites and sketches and extras back here. That's a little, that's a little if, a little disappointing, I would yeah. say. So there's that. Yeah, volume one has extras of these thunder. Volume two has extras. I'm really surprised that volume, um, the A thunder doesn't have any extras. So that's um, something you should know if you are getting the story, if you have like the trade paperbacks and stuff like that and you're buying this for extras, just know that there's no extras in here, but you still get the oversized artwork and stuff like that. So just be aware. So this is the first look of Ascender. I probably will have to review maybe in a week or two or three or four or five. <laughs> Let me know in the comments though. If you want this review sooner than later, then I'll work on it. But if it's like, eh, it's okay, you don't need one, then maybe I won't. <laughs> but yeah, this is a really cool story. I definitely would put this on my... We are going to make like a Christmas list, like a... 
guide. I know Dave is making one. I'm mm-hmm. making one too. This one will definitely be on my Christmas list. So yeah, you can pick up this book at organicpricebooks.com, and I'll see you in the next video.